I'm here in Amsterdam and today I'm looking for Barbie branded items. My first stop is at Claire's. Claire's did not disappoint. They had this pretty sparkly notepad, this really pretty Barbie handbag, this really cool bucket velour hat that has Barbie on it. They had this Barbie necklace and these Barbie hairpins. These are some earrings, a little hairband, and then a fluffy Barbie pen, keychain, so pretty. And then they had this really pretty scarf, little bandana scarf, and a little party kit. This is my first stop and I'll be going to a few more other stores. So we're here in Amsterdam and continuing on our little Barbie brand adventure. I'm looking for Barbie core items here in Amsterdam. Our next stop is Bershka because I saw online they had a whole bunch of different things. But unfortunately we went into this store on Nuyendijk. They had nothing left. They sold out, they said. <laughs> so they told me to walk over to the other um, Bershka store on Kalverstraat. So I did that. I walked over to Bershka and they only had two items left. They had this t-shirt and they had this little cute, I guess, corset type top. It has a zip up in the back. So it's cute, but that's all they have left in the store. So now we're going to magically zap back over to the next store on Nuyendijk. I'll catch you guys there. Okay, so I'm here in Nuyendijk and our next stop is Primark because they have a window display with Barbie and they should have some stuff in here. On the main level, they have makeup, this eyeshadow and some lip gloss, and they have these little washcloths. They told me there was more on the fourth floor, so I went up there and saw this little pajama t-shirt, some fashion tights, this velour pants t-shirt, and some velour shorts. There were some cute socks sitting here next to the mannequin. They didn't have a price tag. I don't know if they were part of a pack. And then they had some laptop stickers and this little notepad shaped like a cell phone. This little pen, did you guys remember these? These are like old school. They have different color inks in them. They have some stationery, I think, or school supplies. I'm not sure, but there's like pencils and notepads. And then they told me there was stuff in the basement for guys. I spotted this reversible bucket hat. It's really cute. And then the guy's outfit here, the pink shorts, and they have these little slippers and the pink muscle t-shirt. These glasses and jacket are not Barbie brand, but this crazy shirt is. It's totally Barbie style. And they have some black shorts here. But that was all they really had at Primark. I don't know if they have more on their website, but we're moving on. Guess what store we're going to next? I'll see you guys there. Okay, you guys, we're at Zara. Are you guys ready for this? This is so cute. They have it just like the Barbie set. You would get like clothing. That dress, unfortunately, is sold out, and so is that bag. You When you walk in, they have everything set up, the little box you can take pictures with. They have all the clothes that you can get that they actually wear in the movies. So like this jumpsuit. So like Zara has the official license to like duplicate a lot of the styles that they wore in the actual movie. So it's really cool. This is the old fashioned Barbie. They have this jumpsuit, it's so cute. There's just so much to look at. <laughs> the pajamas, this is a swimwear. And they have the gingham pink set here. This is a swim set. They don't have the dress, but they have this little cute set. And then they have the iconic swimsuit, the first Barbie. It's like a replica of that. And they have a big table of accessories here, earrings and sunglasses and jewelry, hair clips, little sparkly tattoos, the gold belt, that hat. I think it's Barbie too, the seashell necklace. I went to the other Zara as well on Calverstraat because I was so inspired and checked that place out as well. I wanted to see if they had any different pieces that I might have missed and they did. They had this little bra and panty set and they also had this t-shirt I didn't see over there. They had this little eye mask and this glitter body spray. I was even inspired and I even jumped in the box and took a photo. <laughs> okay, we're stopping into Pull and Bear to see what they have and they have two tops. They have this little tank top and this t-shirt left 
and we're done on Calverstadt. We're going to one last spot, which is the Bayenkorf. I guess I don't know really how to say it correctly, but they have a huge window display on their corner. So it's a big deal because this is like prime real estate right here. And they display all the different little Barbie dolls that have different occupations or, you know, there's more on this side. So we're gonna go inside and see what they have. They told me that they have Barbie toys on the fourth floor and they don't really have any apparel anywhere else. So I came up to the fourth floor and checked out all the Barbies they had. They only had one Barbie movie, um, Barbie left. These are all other regular Barbies that you can just get, but they had one left and it was the Ken doll. This one here in his pastel beach outfit with a little surfboard. So that's the only one they have left. And then they have a Lego Barbie car here. It's really cool. It's a little Barbie convertible. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this little series. I did pick up a couple of items. I got this t-shirt and these little velour shorts. Those are from Primark. And then I also picked up this scarf from Zara. It's 100% silk and it opens up to be like Barbie land. All right, you guys, thanks for watching.